We've got some people who overreacted. I would be lying if I said I didn't overreact. So this guy is giving me problems because I asked him to close the gate. I asked them to, I made a comment because the gate was open. He wanted to open his miserable mouth with his, with his miserable girlfriend. New Jackson is dog park that doesn't know the rules. By the way, I have followers on Instagram. What do you have? What do you have? I have eight friends. I could tell. No social skills. What? Since, wait, huh? What does a dog park gate have anything to do with Instagram followers and the number of friends you have? I have Instagram followers, what do you have? Like, I can't even imagine using that in an argument. How humiliating. Followers, like, that's just a number. You know that, right? Like, that's literally just a number, not to mention half the people buy followers these days. Girl, girl, nobody cares. Nobody cares how many followers you have. I'm a client. I don't have to follow rules here. Yes, you do, because this is a barber school. Give it to me. Right. I will have your ass from right out of here. I'll call okay, the police. Okay. Give me the mirror. No, you cannot take it from my hand like that. Is this real? Yeah, yeah this is very real. real. I'm recording. This is real. Okay. That's great. Thank yeah, you. It's real. Okay. You are not the boss right. in here. No, I'm a client. It doesn't matter. You're She's the boss. A I'm a client. She's a student. So you're not doing good customer service. Uh, not I'm teaching her nothing. I'm sorry you feel that way. I'm sorry you yeah. feel that way. I'm proof. You've been very nasty the whole time you've been really? in here. Yes. How? Very nasty. The first nasty. time. You didn't record the first part of you being in here being nasty. Now, are you I'm ready to go? I'm not being nasty to her. Are you ready to go and pay for your haircut? I want to finish. She will finish, but you're not going to use the mirror while she finishes. She gave me the mirror to check if it was okay. Right. Is that and okay to check? Time, yes, and now it's time to put the mirror down. Okay, but you need to ask me. You have ask some real me. issues. Literally me in the mirror every single morning when I wake up. You have? some real issues. We all have issues, right? It can't just be me. I do think there's more to this story, obviously. I think she makes a good point. You only started recording when I started reacting. What happened here? I don't know how a haircut turns this bad. It's just a haircut. I've had some bad haircuts in my day and I don't get mad at them. I'm one of those people who will not say anything. Are you like that? Like if I absolutely hate it, I'll just be like, <laughs> I can't tell them. I can't tell them. It's so bad. And then I go home and cry. Tell me that you're not gonna stir it or give me a new one. Well, how do I know what to try? Well, how do I know what it tastes like? So if you mess my coffee up, I can't try it? Is that funny, Nate? No. Can you make no. me a new coffee or can you my money back, Nate? Nate, please. I'll video you. I got, I got the right to video whatever I want. If I can record a cop, I can record a dunk and no one's working. Now make me a new one and get my money back. Tough guy. Wow. Oh, oh, you wow. are being tough. You're laughing at me and saying that I can't try my coffee to see if it tastes like It's made wrong. I want a new coffee. I want In my money what back. world? Give me a full refund now. Give me a full refund now. So I'm telling me you ain't giving me back until I pulled the camera out. You just said you ain't getting nothing back. Until I pulled my camera back, you told me I'm not getting nothing. No, I told you to get your money back. No, you said I'm not giving you a new one. That's what you ordered. That's what you told me. I, I, I'm sticking to that. I'm getting your money back. You're not gonna you get said you're not getting your money back until I said pull the camera. Oh my until gosh. I pulled the camera, you start. I'm not getting nothing back. You started acting like a tough guy until I pulled my camera. Ugh. This guy has way more patience than I have. I'll tell you that right now. In what world are you living where you feel that you can just buy something, taste test it, and expect to exchange or return it. Imagine, imagine we got to go to McDonald's, order a meal, taste test. Ooh, are these fries okay? Is this burger up to my standards? And then exchange it on the spot after we taste test it. Bruh, Bruh. you're living in a different freaking universe. We rent, so what does listen, that have to do with it? You can, you can come your dog, to me. Your dog was you on a leash. You don't, you don't bring listen, him in our yard when he's on a leash. I respect you. And don't insult listen, me by I'm saying we rent. I'm not insulting you. I'm just telling you this very nicely. Uh huh. And you can take it. Don't ever come in our yard again. Listen, you got I, it? I respect oh, your I will decision, go to the store and tell your I boss. I do not let my dog poop on your grass. Yeah, you did. Okay, no, I didn't. I catch <gasps> it. Right. So if you Chick can't respect that. Ew! Catch it! What do you mean? When your dog squats, you just stick your hand down there and let it fall into your hand? What are you talking about? Ew! <laughs> Gross! I pick up my dog's poop, but I don't need to catch it by any means. That can hit the ground first. And I will gladly pick it up, but it's not like here. Let me hold my hands for you to poop in. No, 
That's freaking weird. Also, I don't know. Why is your dog even in their yard? I don't get it. I'd be mad if someone's dog was pooping in my yard too, whether they catch it or not. <laughs> that was the strangest argument I've ever heard. He doesn't poop in your yard. I catch it. Is that supposed to make me feel better about the situation? <laughs> Hold on. Watch no, 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 say that. I so you spit my food, right? You gonna say that camera? You. Tell me you spit my Oy. food, that camera. Tell me you spit my food, that camera. I did. <gasps> Come on, let's go to the police station. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I really didn't think she was going to admit it, but she straight up, not only did she say I did, but she told her what she spit in. I spit in your Whopper Jr. Don't admit it. Don't admit it. <laughs> Don't do it. I mean, I'm not encouraging you to spit in someone's food. I think both parties are overreacting. I think the customer is overreacting, which is causing the employee to overreact and to spit in her food. And then it's like, let's go to the police station. Oh, this is so much overreacting. It's McDonald's. No, it's Burger King. If it's Burger King, I guess you can't have it your way. <laughs> Unless you want spit in it. That's disgusting. I've worked in fast food and never, even though I've been very angry at times, I would never spit in someone's food. Ever. Come here, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Hold on. What? Let me see that. Let me see that. Okay. It said credit card LM Smart. That's that's like a goddamn toys right, for right, tanks right. kind of card. But listen, she trying to swipe that motherfucker to get some uh to get some some merchandise. Mm -hmm. Oh sir. I've been trying to tell her swipe it, swipe it. So you can see if you can get some up out of that. That's your card, man. Honey. You know what I'm saying? But she damn serious why thing is a goddamn why real credit card. Man, she out of control, man. Man, you know you can't swipe that. Well, man, what about this one? It's Girl. The same. Girl! Those are toys! Girl, are you dead serious about this credit card? Let me see, let me see the numbers on that. Let me see the numbers on that. Oh honey. Man, it's got Tweety Bird. Get your <laughs> Like literally playing with this exact toy. Literally. I used to work in a daycare as an ECE. <laughs> we had this toy in the classroom. It's funny, but part of me is concerned because she genuinely isn't understanding that it's a toy. She's trying to swipe the card as if it's going to work. She gotta be drunk. There's no way. She ain't sober. No, there's no way. <laughs> There's no way. That is too funny. I wish we could pay for things with those cards. I really wish we could. Wouldn't that be nice? All y'all to know that. You wanna do it on live? We is at McDonald's and this girl over here uh -oh. took and dug into a Cheeto bag, licked her fingers, and then grabbed the customer's food. Customer's food. We don't want that nasty We don't know she been sucking <laughs> We don't know what the hell she been doing. <laughs> oh, oh, it's getting worse. Oh, oh, God. oh she's getting oh. real mad. She's behind the counter. On our food that y'all are eating, she just ate them, licked her fingers, and then did it. You guys need to take a big short. That means wow. I want all At first, I really wanted to hear the story. And I was kind of vibing with it in the sense that, you know, she's just sitting there going on a little rant, telling her story, not getting anyone involved. And then she's spitting on people. She's behind the counter. She's throwing things. Like, she took it to level 10 real quick. Like, she leveled up. You know when Mario, when you, you, you hit those certain things and then your character <laughs> leveled up? She just did that. I don't know why I compared it to that. Like, why did I even think of that? <laughs> I miss that game. You have no authorization to have them move in. Get out of my house. Instead of trying to sell things behind my back, I'm not stupid enough to hit you and do a song battery since you're trying to do crimes in my home, you piece of garbage. I don't even know how she did that. I feel like that's a skill. She w it was almost like she was preaching to the choir. Like she held this powerhouse of a voice, but it almost sounded painful. I've got a lot of questions. <laughs> Something about moving out. She's not gonna hit you because she doesn't want to be charged. She's selling, I don't know. I got no freaking clue what's going on here. And honestly, the only thing I was focused on was her voice and the octave that it was hitting and the aggression behind it. Put the chair down. You can't get out? How'd you park there? 
Oh, you've been parked there? Oh, I didn't notice. You can't get out? No. How come? Are you in a parking spot? Oh, kinda. We're like halfway in oh, this one. No. You can get out. Is that a Mercedes oh, you wow. have? No. Yeah, it gives you a right to park in two parking spots. Oh no, but why'd you do it? So park in two spots because you don't want somebody to scratch your car. What? I can park this truck in one parking spot. It costs more than a Mercedes. And it's twice the size. Yeah. Just don't park in two parking spots. It's not cool. I was just in there real quick. I didn't want to park so far away. I don't know. I understand taking up two spots, like it's rude, don't do it, it's inconsiderate, but it doesn't bother me enough where I'm gonna whip out my cell phone and purposely not let them leave and cause a scene and talk to, like I'm not your mother, I'm not here to lecture you on if you should be doing that or not, I don't have the energy or the time. You think that she's never gonna do it again because you just filmed this and had this conversation with her? Doubt it. Doubt, Doubt it. it. What a waste. Everyone's overreacting. Like, damn! Here's this, sir. Sorry, we didn't meet the standard of quality that you were hoping for today. That's the uh, business card door store manager. And we'll have your other drink out here shortly. Thank you. That was so sweet. Sorry about the wait. Y'all have a Oh, why am I sad? He was like on the verge of crying. My heart! <laughs> And I don't know because I obviously I don't know the whole story, but like he looked like he was on the verge of tears, but he was using everything in his power to handle it maturely, respectfully, professionally, and he did that. Oh, I just want to give him a hug. I feel like he's had a day. So sweet though. He was so nice about that. I don't even know who the f you are. I don't, don't even know who the f you are. And you want me to pay you? I'm the tow man. Well, I don't know you. Why would I want oh to Oh my gosh. Because I got your car on my truck. Okay, well, good for you. Now you could, could, could go with Go ahead. Take me home with it. I don't go ahead. Need take, take me you. away with it. Go ahead. Go ahead. I don't go need ahead. it. Go ahead. Pay for the damage. <laughs> You're making me laugh, dude. Really. Oh, You're making right. a fool out of yourself. What? It's very simple, man. Give me 50 bucks. I drop the car and you're on your way. Why would you like to To drop your car. Why? You do it for free. Or I do it for free? Go ahead. Give me your ride for me. Okay. Get ready. It's gonna be fun. Oh wow. Why? Oh, you should have just paid him. Oh. Ooh, I understand. Sometimes you're feeling a little bit stubborn. So he's like, I'm not moving. Go ahead, give me a free ride. And it's like you say that now until man starts freaking driving and you're still in the car and he takes you straight to the police station or something like that. Then it wouldn't be so funny. Not to mention, that'd be scary. That'd be that'd really be scary. scary. Like, what if the car fell off on the drive? Also, 50 bucks to drop your car? That's not that much. Cause you might like to pay the actual tow fee, like tow trucks are expensive y'all, at least over here they are. So to actually have something towed and then it's gonna be a lot more expensive that way. Oh, that's great. Oh, oh. Now she wants to pay. I don't understand this. She's acting so casual. After all that, trashing the store, she's just gonna walk up and she's like, okay, I'm ready to pay now. Or not. How about we keep the items and you can leave? Oh, we got a feisty little Karen over here. Well, those are some people who overreacted. I've already admitted I overreact. Oh my God, there are so many times where I'm so dramatic and then I have to check myself and it's like, girl, you're overreacting. Do you know a person who overreacts? Or you can be like me and admit your flaws and that you overreact as well. <laughs> Let me know in the comments. I am out of here. Stay classy out there and stay sassy. Bye.